Hey, what's going on guys? It's Jacob here. I have not uploaded a video to YouTube in quite some time now. So I want to give you guys some insight to what I've been doing the last couple months. So because I'm coming back to YouTube again in 2022, I think this is the appropriate time to actually give a proper introduction into who I am. So guys, if you don't already know, my name is Jacob Bettinger. I'm a director, cinematographer, and editor based in the Toronto area. I live in a small city called Brampton right beside it. It's about 45 minutes drive, give or take. And uh, a lot of people clown it, but a lot of the biggest talents in the world come from Brampton, such as Tory Lanez, Director X, Alessia Cara, and uh, a lot of other people as well. The list goes on. I have 10 plus years of media experience doing photography, video, and graphic design. And over the years, you know, through my childhood, my teenage years, into now my adulthood, I really just brought that with me in all aspects and using it every day. I primarily focus on music videos, commercials, and short films or narrative content. Pretty much though, whatever comes my way, I'm down to film it. I also do some photography. I actually started out as a photographer back in 2017, just doing a freelance, of course, for some local artists, for some people for their prom, and just whatever, again, came my way as a freelancer. That's kind of how it is. And now I'm more focused in on just music video, uh, commercial, and short films. So now moving forward, I want to give you guys an update as to what I've been doing this whole time. Uh, if you guys follow me on IG, you probably already know what's been going on. Uh, I recently just finally uh, opened my own production company. It's called Everslate Productions. And just like what I already do, we focus on music videos, commercials, short films, narratives, stuff like that. Pretty much everything, a mixed bag of work, but we are focusing in on commercials and music videos primarily. The main reason I really created Everslate Productions is to separate the two pieces of content between Jake Bettinger and Everslate Productions. And for the longest time, you know, this whole couple of years of just doing freelance video, I've been just going around by myself, hiring people here and there. But the problem was we didn't have a production name. Every time we go on set, people would be like, oh, what's your team called? Like, you know, what do you guys run by? Like, what's your names? We just say, hey, I'm Jacob. Hey, I'm Aaron. I'm so-and-so. It wasn't really that professional. And the shoots that we were doing were very professional. So it was kind of odd to not have an actual name. Now I've been involved in other teams in the past and uh, you know, it just never felt like it was mine, right? Because I didn't own it. I wasn't really running it. I was a face of it, but I never really had the opportunity to run it how I think a business should be run. So with Everslate now being the CEO, founder and main director of Everslate, it's great because we can now hire the people that we need to film the videos that we want to do. So we're really aiming for the high end uh, clientele but we're still, you know, all around budget friendly and happy to work with pretty much anyone for uh, video creation. So if you guys want to, you guys can go follow the IG account Everslate Co. It's a, it's a very small account right now. We just started out. So we're in no rush to kind of get it, you know, globally massive and stuff like that. We're very small and we're patient with, you know, getting ourselves to a higher level. Uh, you know, just everything takes time and we're in no rush. So we want to make sure we do everything perfect and, uh, Try our best. So besides all the updated information about where I've been and of course who I am, uh, I'd like to kind of tell you guys about what I want to do with this YouTube channel. Now, the one thing I will be changing on this channel is the type of content that I'm going to deliver. I want to really give something new and fresh to this channel that may or may not be controversial. In this industry, a lot of people don't like to talk about things. So the one other director I follow named Jacob Owens, he's pretty open about certain things, tips and tricks, not hiding aspects of film to other filmmakers. It's it's really just about sharing and being open. And you know, as directors, especially in Toronto, we go through a lot and there's a lot of artists and just dirty people doing dirty business. So I like to kind of not expose, but just, you know, kind of share a broad spectrum of what to do how it feels and which ways to go about certain aspects uh, while dealing in this industry. Whether that be the music video industry or just content creation as an overall in Toronto. So it will be pretty exciting. I will actually have a couple interviews with directors as well, sharing their insight to pretty much how it is to be in this industry. I think it's gonna be very unique to get a take from another director on this channel to kind of give something I'd say no one has done yet from the GTA. Uh, which is a greater Toronto area if you're not from uh, Toronto or anything like that. I will also try to do more cinematographer breakdowns. I don't really think I have a proper one yet on this channel. I have a Loco Inc. and Flocko Loco video that I tried to do a cinematography breakdown for. It's not just being a regular behind the scenes video, but I do want to break down some of my lighting and some of my uh, angles and shot choices, stuff like that in my music videos that's coming out and some of the past as well. Uh, another thing I'm going to be doing is also reaction videos to my own videos some old ones, new ones, and to other people's videos around the GTA. Some directors I follow have some amazing work 
and I'd like to react to them on channel with you guys. I'm always up to date with what everyone's posting, my favorite directors and stuff like that. So uh, we got like Charlton Visuals, uh, we got Fatty Soprano, uh, David Del Rosario, Samurai Films. They're all dope people. I guess that's pretty much it. Uh, this is just a quick video, pretty short and sweet. Maybe a little bit longer, but it's still pretty short in terms of what I wanted to say. Just a quick update and to let you guys know, I'm going to be back on YouTube again like the old days. I will not promise daily or weekly uploads, just a fair warning. I don't know what my schedule is like yet to really upload all the time. But we'll see if I get back in the groove of it, who knows, I might actually upload a lot more than usual. So if you guys are active, I'm active too. So if you enjoy this video, please leave a thumbs up, comment down below what you think, and of course, subscribe. Uh, if you can hit the notification bell, it just helps me out and you guys can see my videos as soon as they come out. Oh, and of course, if you aren't following me already on my IG, make sure you go do that. It's at Jacob Bettinger on Instagram and uh, I'm pretty much active on there the most. So if you guys want to know about what I'm doing all the time, then that's the place to be. If you're a Toronto filmmaker or creative, you want to get involved with what I do, go on my IG and sometimes I'll be posting a job on my story. So it's a cool place to be and I like to talk to everyone. So just send me a DM. DMs are always open. But anyways, guys, I enjoyed this video. This is going to be dope to come back to YouTube, and uh, I'm excited for more content to come. All right, guys, that's pretty much it. Easy.